And now your weather with meteorologist Gino Recchia. Highs climbed into the lower 80s today, but look to our west. 90s, 100s, eventually that will be here as we welcome in next week's work week. But if you happen to be woken up this morning, it was hard to see out your window. We had some low dense fog, but that did quickly erode getting into the afternoon hours and turned into a mostly sunny day. Beautiful weather to kick it off. A little humid this morning, though, if perhaps you're outside walking the dog or just being outside in general. Some high and mid level clouds are working in here from the west. There have been some pop up isolated showers in far northwestern Wisconsin. But overall, a pretty quiet picture is a weak area of high pressure is sticking around across the southern Great Lakes. A couple areas of low pressure moving across the Highway 80 corridor, all advancing to the east, but doesn't look like we'll be dealing with significant chance of rain, at least for the next 24 to 36 hours. So overnight tonight, we'll have some low lying clouds and could actually wake up with some fog in the morning hours. We'll talk about that shortly, but during the day tomorrow, looks like another sunny stay. Then on Monday, starting off with maybe some low lying fog once again, but the sun will be out and also with it, Temperatures will be quickly rising to the upper 80s to near 90. So for tonight, watch out for that patchy, dense fog. Visibility is down to a half mile with some of that low level moisture. Clear skies, calm winds that quickly erodes. And then once again, we do have the chance of some fog early Monday morning. But with also that fog and that moisture, Dew points will be starting to rise. We'll be back into the mid 60 degree dew point tomorrow. That's getting into that uncomfortable category. And then once again on Monday as well. So with the heat will also come the humidity. Tomorrow won't be too terrible. Highs in the lower 80s. There might be an isolated chance of a pop up shower or storm in the afternoon and early evening hours. But overall doesn't look too significant. So for tonight, we'll have mostly clear skies and some patchy fog where the fog does develop. Low visibility is under a mile or possible, cooling off into the lower 60s with calm winds. For tomorrow, getting into the lower 80s, mostly sunny skies, isolated chance of a shower or storm later in the evening hours. We'll have winds coming in off the lake at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Highs near 90 on Monday, upper 80s to close to 90 on Tuesday. A little cool down on Wednesday before getting back up into the lower to mid and upper 80s. By the end of the work week, high near 90 degrees once again Friday and Saturday. So if you enjoy the cooler weather, unfortunately this seven day is not for you. We'll be back after the break.